going on guys? Young with Hardy Tech. Welcome back to Pokemon Light Platinum the Nuzlocke Run. Today we'll be taking on the Warren region after many many problems with Kimtasia including having to completely re-download and reinstall this amazing, fantastic, always perfect recording software. Um, today we're ready to take on the Warren region Elite Four with our newest team member GLaDOS. For those of you wondering why I named it GLaDOS, when I first got the build and I was thinking of a nickname for it, I looked at his little red eye and it reminded me of the turrets from Portal and somehow I got to GLaDOS from that. So it is Jolly Nature, which I believe Jolly is um, plus speed, lower special attack, which kind of sucks because we got Psychic. So, um, but yeah, whatever. The first member at Elite 4 is a poison type gym, so, or poison type dude, so we'll be taking them on and it's going to be awesome. So, let's go challenge. Okay, you know, yeah, let's just do this already because I'm tired of talking. The Elite Four, can we actually beat this one? Because if we beat this one, then we'll be taking on the Pokemon World Tournament next. Oh, wow! I have a friend named Robin. How weird. I'm going to be beating up my friend Robin. This is going to be awesome. The first member of the Lord's Elite Four, I used the power of poison Pokemon to battle. Yay! You know, this is, like, actually really ironic because me and my friend Robin, who I actually think I mentioned, like, in the junk video, um... We are, we like to play Pokemon games just like on our own. We play games together. And we are currently doing like a mono type run of Pokemon um, Liquid Crystal. And it's kind of ironic that she's chose to do a poison type mono type run. And now we're facing an Elite Four member named Robin who's a poison type leader. So it's kind of ironic. Whoa. Whoa. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What? What just happened? <laughs> okay, that's actually really hilarious. Normally, Memento, I believe, lowers your both physical attack and special attack by. Or it's, I think it lowers your special attack by like six stats, so all the way. But it sacrifices your Pokemon to do that. And because of our ability clear body, our stats can't be lowered, so Muck literally just killed himself for absolutely no purpose. So, good job, Muck. Good job. Cookie for you. Anyways, up. Oh, that's a freaking a dog barking. There's a dog barking. Hold on. I I'm I gotta go punch a dog. One second. Okay, so apparently someone decided to like show up in my house right now of all times and they felt it was necessary to do that when I'm recording so that all the dogs will start barking and then just make me absolutely hate life. So kudos to whoever just showed up and did that. I very much appreciate it. But Anyway, I don't even know if you guys can, like, hear the dog barking, but trust me, like, after I paused it and I was, like, waiting for it, it got even louder because the other two dogs started barking, and it was just, like, this big conundrum of dog barking. you think it was a tree festival with all this bark. Let me just say that much. But let's talk about happy things. Like, tonight is a big, big night, and it already have happened by the time this video was posted, so it's kind of, like, irrelevant for me to talk about it right now. But, ooh, ooh oh, my God, Rock Climb would have done... Probably one shot at Delaney. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> I got so lucky. Anyways, it's already happened by the time this video went up, but tonight is the series finale of Breaking Bad, also known as probably like the greatest TV show of all time. And this, I'm probably going to have like a tiny little fanboy moment right now because I, I like Breaking Bad. A lot. It's typically not the kind of show I watch, too. Normally I watch, you know, either, like, animations or I watch, like, sitcoms. I like sitcoms because I like to laugh. And But for some reason, I decided to watch the first episode of Breaking Bad, and I was just instantly hooked on that show. And I've watched, like, I think when I, st I started watching it in January, so I watched, like, the first four seasons in, in like, two weeks. So, um, anyways, one second. Hey, I'm Wes, the member... Of the elite, a member of the Lord's Elite Four. I use the extreme power of ground Pokemon to win. Oh crap, I still have Metagross out front. That's not good. Um, anyways, as I was saying, so the series finale of Breaking Bad is on tonight. I'm going to try not to talk about it too much because I'm always like really bad at describing things. And if I try to describe Breaking Bad right now, I'll probably just make a mockery of it. So let's not do that because I don't want to make a mockery. Oh, whoa, no. Bad, Claydol, no, Claydol, bad, no, Claydol, 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 <laughs> That's just how my brother died. Uh, why? I should have stayed. Who would have thought Metagross would have been the perfect Pokemon to stay in against? No. I need, 
I need a Chewy. I really need a Chewy. Okay, PB and J, you we got this, right? We don't got this. Oh wait, no, we got Ice Beam. Okay, okay, we got this. We can still do. <laughs> We've already had our first death. Oh my god. Okay, we got this. Um, as I was saying, Breaking Bad, the series finale is tonight, and I'm so excited because I just, oh, I have no idea what's gonna happen. I actually, I've kind of been a. I know I said I was going to try not to talk about this too much, but I gotta because it's just so amazing. But I'm kind of surprised with how, they, well, how the series has gone down, like the fifth season. And there's going to be spoilers here for those of you who haven't watched the fifth season yet. Or the most the second half of the fifth season. So if you don't want it to be spoiled, I'm sorry. Just skip ahead in a video or something or you know, whatever. But anyways, I think like everybody originally thought that the series was going to conclude with like a big showdown between... Hank and Walt, and I promise I'm only going to be talking about this for a few minutes, just because I'm having, like, a big fanboy moment here, so it won't last long, but, um, and then all of a sudden, like, Hank's freaking dead, and it's just, what? And now, the showdown is between Walt and people, like, I don't think anybody expected, like, I don't even remember their names, but, um, the dude's, like, family is now, like, the one Walt's having a showdown with because they took his money, it's like, nobody in their right mind ever could have predicted that happening, and... It did, and it's weird because it's not supposed to happen like that. So, I have no idea what's going on with Jesse. And, okay, I'm done with Breaking Bad. Let's talk about something else. Either way, the series finale tonight. It's already happened. I'm so excited to watch it because it's happening in 45 minutes from now. So, hopefully, I'm done recording by then. Ugh, I just, I want to go watch it. I want to watch it so bad right now. Okay, Pokemon. Let's talk about Pokemon things because this isn't, this isn't Breaking Bad Nuzlocke Challenge. This is Pokemon things. I have really exciting news about my next Nuzlocke Challenge. Some of you probably don't actually care about this, but I thought it was pretty cool. Um... So I'm not telling you what my next Nuzlocke challenge is yet, so I'm sorry if that's what you were hoping for. Um, but my next Nuzlocke challenge will have... Uh, normally, I will use, I've been using the Dream World artwork lately for my um, Nuzlocke's. And before that, I just used like, the official artwork. Well, my next Nuzlocke run... Ooh, so we've got the attack bonus. Now I kind of want to stay in. My next Nuzlocke run is going to be featuring um, custom artwork by Rusty. She'll be drawing custom artwork for every Pokemon I have on my team and it's gonna be freaking amazing I'm so excited about it so um by the way I gave Dino Hyper Beam because he has the highest attack on our team this is just a last resort in case I like absolutely have to hit something really really hard which probably won't happen until the world championship but because you know you got the recharge and if we don't kill it then we're kind of screwed so um yeah either oh my god guys use Odor Sleuth uh why wait doesn't odor sleuth i don't remember does odor sleuth uh makes normal and fighting type moves hit ghost types why in the world would a level 78 houndoom have normal or fighting does houndoom even learn fighting type moves like the only one i could oh man i didn't see what he's sending in the only one i could even think that like he might be able to learn would be double kick so drill pack oh okay i thought drill pack was the one hit ko one at first but i think that's um I think that's Horn Drill is the one hit KO one. I don't think Honchkrow can learn that because Honchkrow doesn't have a horn. Silly Honchkrow, who's dead. Okay, okay, this is actually going surprisingly well. I'm, I'm very happy, and it's finally time for Jerpus is the only one who hasn't done anything in this in the Elite Four yet. He's going to be taking on Umbreon. So the first three, just like in the Zeri region, the first three are going to be really easy for the most part, except the fact that we did lose Obama Snow. <laughs> and the second, the... The fourth member and the champion are gonna, where it's going to get really difficult because with the champion, we're going to be about 10 levels under leveled. His highest Pokemon is 85. So, yay! I'm so excited! Ugh. And what's even worse is if we're, that's going to be challenging the World Championship. We're going to be like 10 to 25 levels under leveled. Like the champion, Ash Ketchum, who's pro that shouldn't be a surprise, has level 6 level 100 Pokemon. So... Yay! I'm so excited! We missed... Oh, crap. Okay. You know what? That's fine. Isn't this, um, her last Pokemon? So, we could just, like, troll it and switch out on the last turn, can't we? Anyways, let's just go for Earthquake and see how much that does. I don't think it would kill. Okay, no. Slash isn't gonna... Slash is gonna do quite a bit. Whoa. Okay, and we'll just finish you off with Extreme Speed. So, is this your final Pokemon? Because... Oh, please be her final Pokemon. Okay, it is, because I was like, oh, crap, wait, that, that means Lucario has one turn left. Okay, okay, good. To achieve great power, you will need a balanced team of Pokemons. That's it? That's all you gotta say? Alright, whatever. So, the final member of Elite Four is 
the very stereotypical dragon type. And I think I'm going to stick with my um, strategy of just leading with uh, Metagross. Because it seems to be working somewhat well, except last time it cost us an Obama Snow. So that made me sad. Why am I using Super Potions here? I don't actually know. I guess I don't want to waste my Hyper Potions. But anyways, let's just go take on a Dragon Girl. Be prepared to face the rage of dragons. I'm Rain, and I'm the greatest dragon tamer in the Lord's Elite Four. Um, okay. Okay, one second. Light Platinum logic, okay? Yes, you are the greatest dragon tamer of the Lord's Elite Four. But that is because you are the only dragon tamer of the Lord's Elite Four. So, that really just makes you sound really egotistical, and I kind of just want to punch you in the face. So if we could just not do that again, if we could just have like a really sane conversation where you don't sound like a stuck up bitch, then that would be fantastic. Okay, thank you. Anyways, let's get on with the battle so I can just kill everything you've ever loved. Okay, that sounds nice. This is what you get for having an ego. I'm allowed to have an ego because my ego really sucks, okay? I have a really crappy ego. You have an ego that makes you sound like you're better than everybody else when you're clearly not because you... Okay, Kingers are actually pretty cool, but... um. Oh god, guys, it's a really fast king right now. Um, I, we'll just keep... S okay, what are you doing? Why are you setting up? Why aren't you using any moves on me? Are you going to do anything? Okay, you're going to use Hydro Pump. I take it back. Don't use any moves on me. I take it back. Please don't. No, 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 no. Glad I was... <gasps> oh, you could have just kept using agility, dude. I was just poking fun at you. I'm so sorry. I just kind of starting to realize, why is GLaDOS only level 70? <laughs> why did I stop at 70? Oh my god. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, we got PB and J who should be able to just be able to ice beam the rest of them and I have a feeling we're not gonna be using GLaDOS anymore now that I realize that he's um she or it's level seventy. Uh yeah. Oh wait, why did Salmance use agility? Why is everyone on her team using agility? Are you all addicted to speed? Do you have a problem? Because we could take you somewhere where you can get this fixed. It's okay. There's people. They will help you. It's gonna be okay. For, you know what, let's switch it up a little, let's go with Dino, and we will, um, actually that was probably a bad idea, because now we have the Sandstorm up for the rest of the battle, but we're gonna Rock Slide, and you have stupid freaking Perish Song, you useless poop, okay, whatever, Rock Slide's still super effective, I don't think it'll one shot, oh my god, are you serious, but the Sandstorm's gonna kill it, wow, that's funny, I find that very funny, <laughs> oh, I'm finding way too much humor in this, I don't know why, anyways, up next is Flygon, so let's, uh, actually, no, Flygon would probably have... Actually, I don't think Flygon learns Earthquake, does it? I think it's, like, the best move it has is Dig. Oh, wait, and we're a freaking flying type anyways. Never mind. Okay, I'm just stupid. I was like, oh, I don't want Charizard to get hit by the Earthquake. Oh, no. It's so stupid. Let's just drag it. Oh, it does have Hyper Beam, though. Whoa. Wait, no. That's bad. Delaney? 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 Oh, my God, dude. You took that so well. What the heck? What? How did you take that like such a beast? My god. You, Ch Charizard, wow. Fab session for Charizard. Just congratulations, man. That was so impressive. I thought Delenny was dead. People were yelling at me to use Delenny for so long, and I finally do. And like his first freaking battle, he gets like hyper beamed. That's just like, oh crap, no. But he survived. Okay, now PBJ, you have to survive one hit from this thing. Just one move. From this Dragonite. Oh, okay, or you could just be faster, because, you know, why not? <laughs> Freaking, just, why does he even, what's the point of those tiny wings if he can't outspeed a giant ass otter? Seriously? Dragonite, you, you, you made me sad. You made me very sad, Dragonite. I was impressed by how well you battled. I was impressed by how much you suck. Your freaking Flygon can't do shit, and it used Hyper Beam, like the most powerful move in the entire world. You know, except, like, v Cree, but that doesn't count, because... It's Victini. Victini's just... Oh my god, I love Victini. It's so cute and adorable. Now that you've beaten the Dragon Tamer, you're almost a new champion of Lauren! Ah! Happy noises because I'm a fag! Yay! There's nothing wrong with that, by the way. That's not used as an insult. I mean... Uh, fag people... Okay, you know what? Let's just get off that topic before I accidentally say something stupid. Anyways, it's time to take on the champion. This is without a doubt going to be the most challenging battle because it's a mixed variety, so we can't just focus on one type. Are we going to win? Are we going to be the champion of the two regions and move on to the world championship to face Ash Ketchum? Let's find out! 
Oh, okay, this isn't auto walk. Well, that's really anticlimactic. Oh, now it is. Wait, Blake. Have we, have we met him before? I don't remember. He looks a lot like Faulkner. Is this just like Faulkner's bro? <gasps> Wasn't Faulkner's dad a gym leader? And then Faulkner's dad left and like Faulkner in charge. What if Falk? This is Faulkner's dad. Oh my god. Dude, I just met a. I just completed the Pokemon storyline. Everything makes sense now. Boom. The first time I saw you, I knew you had great potential. You really are good, but now it's time to face the real Warren League champion. Once again, we had the same problem in Ziri region. What? Nobody's accusing. There's no fake. Lauren Reed champion. We know you're the champion. We get it. There's no fake. You ugh. Agreed Caterpie noises. Oh crap, I forgot you lead with the Charizard. I knew he led with the Charizard and I was thinking, okay, let's read with Tyranitar, but no. I'm a dumbass and completely forgot. Okay, well hopefully Tyranitar can take whatever. Oh my god, now we're gonna have Sandstorm the entire battle. That sucks. Oh god guys, he has Dragon Rage. Oh no. Ow. Why does Charizard okay? Why does Charizard get Dragon Rage so late? I mean, I think he learns it in like the 60s or 70s. How in the world? And Fire Spin! Charizard gets Dragon Rage and Fire Spin such late levels, and they're both such crappy moves. I mean, Dragon Rage can't like Oko anything at this level, because nothing is 40 HP besides Shedinja. And freaking Fire Spin has like 15 base damage. Just, why? <laughs> why, why are you just trolling? I mean, they're just like trolling Charizard, because people love Charizard so much. He's like the OG tr Pokemon. And so Nintendo's just like, well, hey, guess who we're going to give a really crappy moveset to? You! Yeah. Unless this is just Light Platinum, I don't know. Because um, Beldum, like the Beldum line, actually got a brand new moveset, I think. Because normally Beldum only gets takedown, but my Beldum had um, Hypnosis, Confusion, I think Tackle. He learned Extra Sensory at like level 18. Um, it was really weird, so... I don't, I don't know. Ooh, okay, let's go with... Oh, wait, no. I know Hydreigon learns a lot of special moves. I don't remember if he learns Flamethrower by level up. Um... Alright, let's risk it. Come on, Jerpus, you got this. You can cross chop him, right? Oh, this is his highest level Pokemon. This is it. It's Jerpus versus the best. Outrage. Okay, we resist Outrage. That's good. But Hydreigon actually has really good special... Really good special attack. Whoa! Okay, that was a... If that would have one shot at Jerpus after like I was bragging about how he resists Outrage, that would have made me so sad. But is Cross Chop going? Oh, Cross Chop didn't one shot. Okay, it's okay. We just Hyper Potion. And he can't Hyper Potion because he's locked into Outrage. And this time Outrage should do less than half. So, okay. Okay, this is good. This is good, guys. Now we can just Extreme Speed. And then Hydreigon is dead unless he Hyper Potions. Which actually no one's used items yet, which is really weird. Yeah, why is nobody using items? I don't like that. That, like, takes away all the fun. I like when people use items. It makes it more exciting. Aww. I should just stop using items. You know what? I'm not going to use items the rest of this battle. Just to be fair, because he's not using items. Uh, I could stay in and go for Earthquake, but I don't want to risk that because his Jerpus will have a Fighting-type move and we're weak to fighting. His Jerpus. His Lucario. No, it's, it's, we're just going to change Lucario's name to Jerpus now, because that's just such a fantastic name. Okay, no more items, rest of this battle, we're going... Oh, wait, no, I didn't want to fly. I didn't want to fly. Charizard, get back here. Charizard, get back. Charizard, Charizard, no, no, come back here. Come on, get back here, Charizard. Okay, thank you. And wow, okay, oh, I was going to say, that did so much, why? Okay. It's okay, we just gotta live one move, whatever it's gonna use. We resist fighting type moves and steel type moves. Um, I don't think extreme speed would kill us. Let's see. Reversal. Oh my god, wait, no. Oh my god, that's what killed my dragon type Pokemon, I can't remember. Um, or, that killed somebody. Who did reversal kill? I, no, I think reversal killed, um, uh, Bronzong. So, Kario freaking trying to pull a fast one on me again. No way. Alright, Arcanine is up next. Is this... I don't remember how many Pokemon he has left. He's used, like, so many Pokemon now. It's just... Okay, it's two Pokemon left. After Arcanine and something else. My god, guys, we're actually gonna do this. I just... We're gonna do this. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. And then we're gonna go to the World Championship, and we're gonna win that. And I'm gonna win my first on-screen Nuzlocke. Or Arcan... Or... No! Wait! No! Who are you sending out? Who are you sending out? Who, okay, you know what? I'm okay with that. Um, I probably should have realized, like, hmm, we actually outspent an Arcanine, that seems a little weird. But we didn't, and we are going to finish this off with a Earthquake. 
Oh my god, he has Ember. <laughs> it's so pathetic. I I don't feel accomplished anymore. I This would be more accomplished if the Pokemon had custom moveset, but they just have their level up movesets, which makes this just... It's so pathetic. It's not even fun. It makes me very sad. And we're going to finish... Okay, let's see. We just... I, don't, I think GLaDOS is the only one we haven't used in this battle yet. So let's use GLaDOS and we will use Meteor Mash to win us our... Or we won't use Meteor Mash. And I think now... Yep, okay. Wow, okay. That was a tricky move. Oh, sh that did a lot of damage. Um, let's use it. No okay, now we can use Meteor Mash. Hopefully actually hit it, maybe. I don't know if it'll kill it. I think... I don't remember Zoroark is bulky or not. I don't think, bul I don't think it's very bulky. Or I could just, you know, live and make a fool out of me. And no matter what, it's dying on this turn, so... Goodbye. You're gonna die while you're sleeping. We put it to sleep. Oh my god. GTS. Go to sleep, baby. Goodbye. And that is it. We are now the champion of the Orange Region. This is so anticlimactic. Man, I hope the World Championship is better than this. This is making me sad. Not if you conquer the Zeri Region. The first thing I'll say is congratu- Wait, no, what? I just beat the Warren Re- Wait, what? You were said wait, no, I just, I beat the Warren League. Pay attention, not the Ziri. Okay, I did beat the Ziri one too, but. Hardy, that was amazing. I'm so proud of you. Your dad would, wait, whoa, I have a dad? Cool. He'd say the same thing. Congratulations, I'm so happy for you. Your mom and I came to cheer you on, but we missed it. Hardy, the time to enter your Pokemon Hall of Fame. Come with me. Come with me and take my hand. This is getting really weird. I like sand. I like to put sand between my legs so my crabs don't feel so lonely. Hardy, this is the lore and Hall of Fame. You'll be recognized throughout the Pokemon world as a Pokemon master. Type your name and team of Pokemon into the machine. Oh my god, guys, here we go. Oh, oh my, whoa, whoa, weird screen glitch. Okay, are we actually gonna, no, we still don't get it, okay. I just want to see all my Pokemon, like, pop up on that fancy screen. It's like, hey, you won the Hall of Fame. You're not a complete failure at life. But that's never going to happen because I'm always going to be a failure at life. Anyways, next time, guys, we'll be taking on the Pokemon World Championship. Assuming that's next in the story. We'll be taking on with the five Pokemon we have. We're not going to get any more team members the rest of the series. And if this is so, the next episode will be the finale of Pokemon Light Platinum. So until then, either I win or I lose. We'll find out. I'm Hardy Tech Yo-Yo. Peace!